Welcome all to the new vlog, and we're starting off by fixing my Republic dropship with ATOT. I probably should have shown you before, but these rods here, you can kind of see that one, are broken, or the Technic axles, and they're they're not broken, but they're bent. I had to take them out so I could bend it like Beckham and make it straight there so that it's, uh, I guess it's not bent anymore, so it's not being bent like Beckham. But the point being, uh, it, the mechanism wouldn't work. When you would come in and you would push, basically this would be up higher. When you would put this piece onto that to like put the dropship onto the ATOT or the AT or even one of the turbo tanks, it wouldn't do anything because these were bent and there was way too much friction for it to pop back or whatever it does. So now it should be fixed. Watching the Red Sox game, editing my fighter tank review. Please hit a home run right now. That'd be dope. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm the prophet. Well, the Red Sox got absolutely hosed and robbed last night, but we're not going to think about that. It's Celtics opening day. I'm really excited about that. But also, Lego set showing up in the mail today. I don't know why I'm excited about it, because it's stuff I already have, but like when it gets here, I'll show you. About to head out to play basketball, but delivered in the garage, we got a couple Walmart packages. These are, these are big boys here. Should be some good stuff in this. And inside we have the all new, just released Lego Star Wars Luke Skywalker battle pack, adventure pack, whatever you want to call it. It's, uh, it was 50 bucks, $80 value. Walmart had it on sale, it's pretty good. I guess only at Walmart, there you go. That answers that question. So yeah, includes nine minifigures, ooh, just a bonus, eh? Uh, I wonder what the copyright on this is. I guess it should be 2021, even though everything inside of it is 2020, yeah. Interesting, but uh, nonetheless, I'll be doing a video on this, not a review necessarily, because like I've already reviewed each of these sets individually, but this is something I think if you don't have all three of these sets, most people should just go out and buy. Totally throw one for my Warzone team to watch basketball. <laughs> like, pretending to do something. Dude, let's go. Is that Schroeder that made? No, Smart. Oh, I love Marcus Smart. He's the best. So I was working on my worst of first rate Clone Wars set, and I was talking to Sans about it, and we've decided to live stream trying to put everything in order because it's a pain. So we're going to put the experience to the test live on twitch.tv slash gutter chicken. Hopefully it works. Ooh. So Sans and I, we've been working on this. That thing looks great. A coat room? A second? Wait, they have two bathrooms? What? <laughs> it's so ridiculous. We're working on the list. It's going pretty well. We have, we have been going through a lot of stuff here. It's been quite a process to get, to get the order of all these sets. Well, thank you to Sans for helping out four hours to make the list, and who knows if it's actually any good. People are going to be so pissed at this list. The Venator is way too low for... Of course they're going to be upset. All right, well... Meh, all right. Hello, can I get uh, two chicken biscuits and a glazed donut? All right, they take off. Not a bit. Apparently, they've got glazed donuts at McDonald's now, so... Gotta try one. I'm ready to go to sleep after that four-hour bout with Sands on which Lego sets go where. But uh, I'm excited. Uh, glazed donut. All right, let's see what we're working with here. This is the brand new McDonald's McCafe donut. Just two food here. Oh no, I don't need this. It's my base layer. Oh, it's kind of small. Definitely kind of small. Seems very glazed, though. There's my hand for comparison. I feel like a Dunkin' Donuts donut's, like, a bit bigger. Um, let's, let's take a bite, I guess. See how it is. Ah, jeez. Oh, yeah. I can... It's not. No. Dunkin' Donuts is cheaper and better. Dunkin' is better. This feels like a two-day-old donut. That's what it is. Honestly, it might be. Who's to say? But, uh, yeah, I'm good. I won't be getting that again. Woke up and I'm right, watching the, uh, out. Hasbro Pulse right, Con much better than Lego Con. I can't. These guys just know what they're talking about. They're like, we listened to the fans online. They liked this thing. So now we're doing this pack of figures with Rebels on top of the Stormtroopers. These are the new Black Series. Hux, ooh, is that an at, -AT? No, it's not, but it's like a first order at, -AT driver. Maybe it's an ATM6 driver, I don't know. I like that. I'll be buying that. That's coming to Galaxy's Edge, I think, for uh, Black Series. 
It's like Christmas out here. There's just like four packages. What's going on? So I got the UCS Naboo Starfighter for about $400. The box is opened. It's not even like opened all the way though. It's just that top part of the flap and the bags are sealed. Basically stole that from eBay, $400. The cheapest otherwise is like $850. And I was almost ready to cave and pay $850 for one, but this came up and it was a no brainer. Um, then I got all this stuff from Timmy here. I guess he sent me tape <laughs> hold on oh and then i got the black series these have been rolling in one at a time uh this is chirith and way hold on uh, it's right. quick question yeah why did you send me tape what the i didn't send you tape well there's tape in the box <laughs> dude i'm telling you man this is weird, man. And sometimes in people's packages, they get stuff that I didn't send. Like, I don't even know how that even happened. It's, I don't think there's any tape left on it, but it's just like three empty rolls of tape. I'm going to go ask my dad. Here, give me a sec. He packs my orders. Let's go ask him together. <laughs> right, you, you, I, I want to I see that. Hell? And I got this today. Oh, that's so sick. It's very exciting. It'll actually go pretty well with the uh, episode two chase in here. I'm, I'm building that today. I really wanted to build that. The, the episode oh, hey, two set. Yeah. Ryan wants to know, did you purposely put this in? He's asking why there was tape in his... <laughs> A viewer named Andrew, who lives out in Texas, messaged me and sent me an image of some crazy knockoff Lego sets at his Five Below store. So, we're gonna give it a shot here in Florida and hopefully get some knockoff Ryan's World stuff. Oh my lord, it's bright out. Let's go. This has to be the dumbest thing I've seen. It's an RC car, Baby Yoda, and a pram. They got a bunch of other Star Wars stuff. They still have Solo stuff, which is crazy. She looks terrible. Not Black Series. We need Ryan's world, though. Would you look at that? Looks like we got three distinct sets for $5 each. Oh, it's not a Ryan's World base plate. That's kind of a shame. I don't know why they don't have that as well. Huh. Okay, we'll get these, and I will hate myself for it. Oh, they have these, too. I already have these. Oh, no, these aren't Ryan's World. These are... Are they? No. I just looked up higher, and I found out why we don't have LEGO SpongeBob. It's because we have this crap instead. Tragic. So we got the brand new Ryan's World Legos. It was kind of awkward. The cashier is like, "Oh, these are brand new. We just got these in." And I'm like, "Oh, nice." <laughs> like, like I like, like if it was a Lego set, I'd be like, "Oh yeah, you know, I track these down. This is fun." But it's like, it's Ryan's World. I've, I'm embarrassed that I'm here already. Okay, I <laughs> did. I didn't want to be here buying these. Um, it's yeah. I also bought the SpongeBob stuff, so we'll do some videos with that. It'll be fun. So the Red Sox were playing the Astros in game six tonight, and I totally forgot I'd been watching basketball for the last two hours and building the Timmy Sing. So I'm going to ask Siri what the score is two hours into the game and hopefully not be disappointed that the Red Sox season is over. Red Sox score. The Red Sox are losing to the Astros 1-0 to zero in the bottom of the sixth inning in game six of the ALCS. Okay, I want to go play Call of Duty and not think about it. It's Monday and I was about to film Ask m &R. However, I wanted to wear my costume for it since Halloween is on Sunday. It's the la it's the video I feel like this should be in. Um, and I realized I cannot find a black long sleeve shirt to wear. So I got my black pants on, but I can't find a black long sleeve shirt to wear. So we gotta go to Kohl's and get one because I gotta have this on for the video. I don't think I can wear the mask for the video though because this is the talking hole. That's just not going to be loud enough. It's not going to sound good. So yeah, we're going to Kohl's. Maybe we'll find some Legos there too. And yes, Legos with an S. Dislike the video, I dare you. <laughs> it's been a lot harder than it should have been to find a long sleeve shirt. Please have large. No. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, there we go. All right, perfect. And only 20 bucks. What a steal. This will work. Ooh. Ryan's World crap. Definitely don't want to buy more of that. I was kind of hoping they would have 
new Batman earlier, but it doesn't look like they have any Batman, so. Oh, there's a hole. Come on. Come on. Baby Yoda, no. Looks like no, no luck. Oh well. Who gets lucky these days anyways? <laughs> Not me. Couldn't be. Yeah, all right. I just got these black shirt, white shirt. We're good. I was still looking around and I found someone had uh, opened a Sith Trooper battle pack back here and left it to die. So maybe some lucky kid will come along and get some free Lego, but won't be me. <laughs> As a kind of big crypto investor guy, uh, it is funny because I saw a tweet the other day. It's like, what's the difference between Kohl's Cash and Bitcoin? <laughs> I'm like, oh, is there? I don't know. <laughs> One's worth more, that's for sure. So I found something out. I, I ordered my new computer again because I got I upgraded a little. But found out you can connect the laptop to the monitor and it works great. So I actually ordered a mouse and keyboard that I can use separate so I can just use my big 1440p monitor. It's excellent. This is a great idea. I don't know why I had never thought to do this. So yeah, that'll be here in a day or two and that'll be have a much better workflow for, for editing videos like Ask of an R. Nice. Much, much better screen real estate. Can't, can't go wrong with that. It's here, it's finally here, my new scuff controller. Oh boy. I really hope this works out for me because this would change my gaming life again. It's been a rocky road for me. Ooh. Ooh, we got it. Oh good, that looks clean, dude. I don't know if anyone ever you Oh man. Here it is, this is the Scuff Vantage, both the bane of my existence and my favorite controller ever. So pick your poison there. This is got side buttons. It's got four more on the bottom. We're going pro, fellas. We're going pro. It is. It does feel a bit smaller than my, my PS5 controller, I'll say that. So I think this shows pretty well why I couldn't use this controller. This is by far the nicest controller I have ever purchased. If you own an Xbox and you're already used to like whatever controller size this is, buy this. It is so nice, so well built. Unfortunately, just too small for my hands. You can see how much smaller it is than just the Vantage, which is, you know, it's not too much. Actually, shoot, it might be as wide. It's hard to tell. It's not, these aren't objects that are particularly easy to line up next to each other. But I mean, it's it's very close as far as the width goes, regardless. Maybe back to back would be a bit easier to tell. I think the, the sticks on this are a little bit longer. But nonetheless, way closer in size than this is to either of them. As you can see, much smaller. Not a fan of how small that is. Everything's just so tight. These are really close to each other. Didn't like that. My fingers would hit each other. Just not an enjoyable experience. So we're back. It's about to head off to the gas station, uh, but to end this vlog, I got to make the sad concession that baseball season is over and basketball season is here. So the lights got to be changed to green and we're set. Basketball season, good to go. Much better match. Darkness is my ally. Thank you guys so much for watching the vlog this week. And I'll see you next week. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new here. Dab on the haters. God, I feel dumb. <laughs>